All right, and this is an Elite 200. I have the fan removed. We're at the back of the boiler. You take two screws out, and here's the flapper valve. And one of the things you don't want to see when you pull that out is a bunch of creosote built up inside there. Uh, this area should be clean. And I'll show you an example. Here's what it ought to look like. That passage should look just like that. Both these boilers are the same age. Uh, this boiler has not been breathing right. As you can see from all that creosote in there. This is an Elite 200. And this is a, if you see one of these on your boiler, then yours is a version 2 enhanced is what they were referred to and that means that in the primary burn chamber there was stainless steel uh, right there down through the secondary burn chamber and back up on the other side so inside here another quick way to tell is this panel right here if the the two screws that hold this panel on top and bottom here are eight millimeter then it's a version two uh, if they're eleven millimeter it's a version three which is an all stainless steel but on a version two enhanced you have this tray in here and this all needs to stay cleaned out underneath this tray as you can see this thing is all plugged up with creosote and ash uh, so it's not getting good air to the secondary burn and it's also not getting good air because air comes up through these ports for primary burn air and if you can see inside here uh, this this passage see if I can get to it here this passage yeah I can't really show it but it's all plugged up there's there's all sorts of creosote inside here and this should be a clear passage so you've got to remove the fire brick on the right side of the boiler and you pull that stainless steel baffle off then you can clean all that whole area out and then your boiler will breathe better and start burning better